ha 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 ha. I wasn't gonna touch it. Ha <laughs> ha ha. Hi. Hey. Hello. Today we are gonna be doing a little um, sit down, chill reaction commentary. What do I even say? Video about my newest, favoriteest show that now I literally watch every single day because I think it's so good. It's really quality television and I don't even watch television so I wouldn't even know, but this is quality television. I don't actually watch like the television version of this show, but I just like watch like the clips and stuff on YouTube and sometimes they post full episodes. So the show is called Bondi, wait, what's it called? Bondi Rescue. It's basically about all the lifeguards at Bondi Beach in Australia, I think maybe um doing their job it's like such a weird like reality show like it is a reality show but i feel like it's not scripted because like it's just like the what they do on the beach you know i don't know but they have different compilations on their youtube here i'll show you they have almost a million subscribers um i'm subscribed as you can see so sometimes they post full episodes but i think it's pretty funny because like the thumbnails are so like youtubey like look like they're little like outlined here this one has like dimming with a little circle like these are some quality freaking like YouTube thumbnails and some of the videos will be like full episode Bondi rescue Bondi rescue delete after 24 hours like this one I'm like that's so like youtuber of them you know I don't even know how they're allowed to like show this on TV or YouTube because some of it is literally people like almost dying or like being like dead for like five minutes and then them resuscitating them and that's insane to me that they just put that on TV and YouTube and stuff but like educational I guess I don't know but it's pretty intense but we're not gonna look at that today because that provides no comedic value anyway so today we're gonna look at a couple we're gonna look at wackiest animal rescues on Bondi Beach. I've never seen this one, as you can see. Oh, a sea snake. I've never seen that. Shanna. Sea snake. Sea snake's a deadly creature. We couldn't leave a sea snake swimming close to the flags. Nah. No. Um, the preferred option would be to get it out of the water completely. Just what is a sneeze? What is a sea snake? Is it like... A few milligrams of sea snake venom is enough to kill 1,000 adults. They're the most venomous snake in the world. Any updates on me? Tommy's a young guy. Some of the, the, the newer members to the team are, are eager to impress, you could say. It's only after Tommy volunteers gets all the facts. They are super deadly. Um, please exercise all due caution. He's like, the second. He's like, I'll do it. And they're like, yeah, uh, it can basically wipe you out in one shot. And he said. Like, and Dino said deadly. That's where I realized I've, um, I messed up. People have died from sea snake bites. It's a fact. Yeah, I know. Just playing with deadly creatures. I'm not scared of snakes. Ah! At least I didn't think I was. The music is like a freaking James Bond movie. He said, I'm not scared of snakes. He said, ah! <laughs> With the pressure mounting, Tommy turns to his previous experience as a tradie. Being a carpenter, I knew there's a tool for every job. And when I was in the boat, I seen the paddle. And I was like, that's the tool for this job. He reached in and grabbed it with the oar and flicked it into the bucket. Job done. Capturing the sea snake and nobody harmed was the best case scenario. Thank you. No Tommy! You hero. Hi, Turns out I'm scared of snakes. You just need some rest. Eventually, we had a snake catcher come along and pick him up. It's not often we find these things. Um, they're fairly venomous as well. The snake... Man's literally said, right, yeah, 
they're kind of venomous. Um, yeah, fairly venomous. Like what? <laughs> actually recovered which was really good and he was released later that day in a secluded beach at the harbour oh i love how they um they protected the snake i'm gonna wear this guy for the rest of the time i like how they protected him instead of you know sending him off this is our new friend snakey is he going up there he was a skater rat a rat in the skater bowl. Bro, why is it no. look like that? I saw it in the manual. It's a pretty big scene up. Oh my god, Mr. Snakey would eat that. That is so funny. Why does it look like that? It said... <laughs> Here there's people everywhere, so we're gonna come up and... If it's not too vicious, we'll try and catch it, throw on a pair of gloves and... Do our dirty work. Vicious. We can't leave a cops here dealing with it. Yeah. Oh my god, a bit, a bit, diff a bit different saving a rat than a human. It's most probably gonna be harder. When I get to the skate bowl, the coppers are doing nothing. Oh my god, there's four so cops for like, one rat. I'm dead, rat. bro. Like, I'll do it. Like, who cares? I'm just gonna touch it. <laughs> I'm just gonna hold near it. Ha 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 I wasn't gonna touch it. Ha 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 ha. That's a big it boy. It just straight in. Job done. How easy was that? <gasps> As soon as I looked at it, it was just eye contact. Oh and just my like, god! Bang, let's go. And I was kind of like, whoa. I didn't think rats were vicious. What is that? Is that another snake? <laughs> Wait, it keeps slipping. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! What's in there? Definitely, I knew it wasn't my jacket. As if I'd use my jacket to put on a rat. <laughs> Oh my god, and I'll get one. Let's look at another um like compilation or whatever. Oh, crazy celeb encounters. Lifeguards swing into crowd control. <laughs> Who do they see? Michael Jackson. Celebrities wash into Bondi as often as the tide. This time, it's hip hop superstar Snoop Dogg. Just trying to see if I can see him. Yeah, I, I, I'm pretty sure it's him. What's He's it? got a three quarter length white sort of jacket on with like stripes on it. Harry isn't as hip as he hoped. This is Snoop Dogg. That's his Yeah, bodyguard. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> Snoops at Bondi for an MTV shoot with Hollywood star so Sophie Mark. And some other girls having a little trouble keeping their tops on. It's a bit of a... The commentator. They're having a little trouble... No, that's not the right accent. They're having a little trouble keeping their tops on. Like, that's not... Also, why does this look like it was literally filmed in 2007? Like, wh I'm pretty sure this show is, like, still around and stuff. Yeah, like what they're wearing, like they're wearing like so low-rise jeans and stuff. Like I'm just confused. Like the camera is very 2007, like Jersey Shore vibes. Snooping. Like look at that. So I'm not going anywhere near him. Maybe I'll just run up and give him a kiss or something and see what happens. Snoop Dogg and his heavyweight hounds. Snoop Dogg. <laughs> Head for the hills, leaving Chapo without an autograph. Yeah, it was very disappointing, I suppose, but you know, it's showbiz, I suppose. So you can't be bigger than showbiz. It's New Year's Eve, and the Bondi party season is reaching a crescendo. Is this allowed? As the beautiful is people are flat out touching up their tans, there's a sudden commotion. Oh my god, I'm gonna get this person. Public safety. It's literally so funny. This is totally 2007. Like, I... There's no way that this is current. There's no way. I was just editing, obviously. And I just realized... This show is not even from, like, 2010. It's literally current. Because... I was looking through this, like, screen recording... And this episode has to do with coronavirus. 
Why do they dress like it's literally 2009? What the heck? Whip it, normally never short of a word, is speechless. The old guard, like H, Paris is a place, not a person. It's just another day at Bondi. Some is like, you know, you once in a lifetime kind of thing. I've watched the Victoria's Secret it shows as a kid growing up. I don't know if it was a kid, probably <laughs> an adult. <laughs> Mouse, Bisho, and Whippet are joining Heidi in a photo shoot for the German supermodel's clothing label. She's got an undie label, she's coming down, and we're just. I have never heard the word undie label enter the atmospheric space. Undie label. She's got an undie label coming out? Like what? Undie label? Mouse is concerned he's not quite male model quality today. A few days um, before the photo shoot, I had some physio done um, with some suction cups <laughs> and um, Basically, my whole body was just a big bruise, oh and uh, um, I was looking absolutely terrible for it. But Whippet has his own image problems. He had a spare 10 minutes before Heidi Klum's arrival, oh, so he's bolted out for a surf, and uh, he's actually got stung oh, across the face by a blue bottle. After mocking numerous people yesterday for it. <laughs> um, uh... One lifeguard who always maintains peak condition for just these opportunities is Harry's. Harry's turned up as well, and he loves this Hello. stuff. He's born for this stuff. He loves this stuff more than lifeguarding or anything, you know? Except he's been kept in the dark about this one. Harry's is... I changed my mind. Jesse was my favorite character, but now Harry's is. When I wasn't chosen for the Heidi Klum shoot, you know, was I upset? Harry's just comes straight out of the set. Oh, look at his face. <laughs> I wanted to see him in the underwear. I wanted to see if they looked as good as I. You know, you don't admit a lot of things in life, but before I get in my underwear, I get a spray tan. These boys were a little pale. He was so jealous. I loved it. No lookout is required oh to spot the German Roasted, supermodel. Literally who's demolished. taller than her security oh, guard. Oh, I'll keep my shirt on. <laughs> Wait, she really Not tall. very often that I'm speechless. Yeah. And maybe you guys look that way and I She's really old now. Oh my god, all their glasses are so like stylish. Like the square top ones. And the hottest. Heidi Klum, one of the boys. Or we could say Mouse, Whip It and Be Show. Victoria's Secret models. Yeah. <laughs> Now you all have seen my new favorite show. Um, also, subscribe or else you're lame. Hope you enjoyed that little fun little video, little video, little. Um, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.